Let's start with this map now. I actually forgot to make a save um, at the end of my previous episode, so I had to like reload one of the auto saves, which this game does every time you win a mission. Basically the exact same thing, but I suppose I have a different starting hero now, which shouldn't affect anything though. So first of all, I would uh, need to build a well, but well is already built, so we can get to the castle introduction, which I never did. So the Barbarian is actually the second cheapest castle, uh, along with the Knight. It's like, I assume, the counterpart for the Knight, for the Archibald's evil's side. Uh, there are Goblins. Goblins are decent-ish. Speed average allows them to do something on the battlefield overall, and they do some damage potentially, but it's still just a tier 1 unit and they're pretty much irrelevant or they become irrelevant very quickly. Then there are orcs. Orcs are rearranged unit. Upgraded orcs move slow. Uh, move speed is slow. Very slow for normal orcs. They are not really that good, but they could like... You could have a decent amount of them and then they can start doing some damage. Regardless, ranged units can have some use in this game, regardless of what tier they are. So, they are somewhat useful, even just because of that. Then we have wolves. Wolves uh, are definitely useful, at the very least, just for allowing your heroes to move a bit quicker. And they also do a decent amount of damage by themselves. They have a double attack, so yeah, they die quickly. They don't actually have a lot of HP and defense. But uh, very fast speed definitely counts for something, which is even more relevant for Barbarians, since they don't have any flying armies. Then we have Ogres. Ogres are ridiculously tanky. Ridiculously tanky. Um, upgraded Ogres can move with speed average, which makes this upgrade pretty much a must-have if you want to use Ogres at all in this game. Uh, but upgraded Ogres are... Pretty damn good. Very, very tanky. Can do some reasonable damage, I suppose. Though they don't really... They aren't really used for dealing damage usually. Just for tankiness. But for that purpose, they definitely do work. Then there are Trolls. Which is like... One of the main units, honestly, for Barbarians. It's a ranged unit. I think they can regenerate their HP. But it's uh, not really that useful overall. And it's like, you know... It is a gimmick, it doesn't really... what makes... it's not what makes trolls. It's mostly just them being ranged and have a decent damage, and that's about it really. But a very solid unit though. And then there are Cyclopes. Uh, Cyclopes cannot be upgraded, and they are not that strong. They cannot, like, compete, really, with uh, either Black Dragons or Titans. Not really even close, not, in, not even in the same universe. But they're cheap, and the same can be said about all of the other buildings and units in the Barbarian's army. So yeah, that's uh, the main selling point of the class overall. And the only like, there are two weak points, kinda, for this castle. One of them is that there are no flying armies. And the second one is that uh, late game it might present some problems since uh, competing with like black dragons and titans and stuff like that might be a bit of an issue. But we will not be doing any of that in this mission. Uh, it it uh, well first of all there shouldn't be any wizards or warlocks in this area anyway. And the first question is well let's just build it then. First of all it's ridiculously cheap anyway. So do I. Um, those nomads are very fast. I could either use them, or I could use wolves, who are also very fast. Which one do I want to do? I kind of want to, I think... Technically, wolves are stronger. But there is a bigger stack of nomads that I don't really want to split, if I can help it. Uh, no, I'll still do nomads, I think. So let's just do some scouting done, first of all. I do have money, right? Yeah, I do have some money. Let's see what do we have first of all. Whoa, 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 whoa. So that's uh, Ancient Lamps is the place where you can hire genies. I know that. I don't remember exactly what price do you have to pay for them. 
Interesting. Okay. Well, one more scout. I kind of want one scout in this area and maybe one scout to go there as well. Maybe I should have used my other barbarian to scout uh, off-road some more. Since I will need to send someone in that direction. Navigation, maybe just a uh, wizard? Also, if I hire a wizard, I don't really w need to spend nomads anymore. I can just go on boars. I do need to go and kill these goblins. Also, I don't remember what is the troll bridge. Can you, like, hire them there? I'll need to find this out. So, lots of goblins. Well, it's easy to deal with uh, just by using nomads, pretty much. So, maybe just do something like this. Can even split them, probably. Okay, and then you just go there. You can, like, get this uh, gold pile and wait around this tile for now. And I do need one more hero. Mendigo, maybe? Maybe something like this. <sighs> I'm not sure where to begin. Probably just there. Do I need, like, gems for genies? Well, I should probably have enough, though, even if I do. Let's, let, let me get some regardless. It's fine. Okay, I can get this chest, but skeletons are not really killable at the moment. Okay, and uh, I think that will be a skip. So... Let my scouts do their work, work first of all. Orcs, and the sulfur mine after that. Interesting. Okay. So what about this witch's hut? Estates. Well, that might be useful. Um, let's kill those goblins first of all. How much damage do I do? Whoa, attack skill 7. I probably can kill... Um... I can calculate how much damage will I do. Let me do so, actually. Attack skill 7. What uh, defense do goblins have? 1. Which means I'll do 60% more damage. Which means one nomad will do 3.2 damage at the minimum. How much HP do they have? 3. So I'm always killing at least one goblin. And up to like 2.5 of them with every hit. It should actually be even better, probably, to split it into... Honestly, maybe even five squads? Maybe even five squads. I might lose some nomads because of that. But, um... Yeah, maybe it will be better. Let's try this out. Okay, they uh, run away anyway. That was anticlimactic. Before I get those genies, let me just in case uh, combine my armies, and then let's see how much do they cost. I don't think you need to fight them. You stumble upon a dented and tarnished lamp lodged deep in the earth. Do you wish to rub the lamp? Yes. Yeah, you can just buy them. That's okay. That's ridiculously cheap, by the way, for how good the unit is. Ridiculously cheap. Definitely hire all that I can. Yes. Four in total, and then, well, that's a corner of the map. There is nothing there anyway. Let's just go and rush them, maybe? Huh. Like, I can kill those, uh... I should go and check this troll place. I'm not sure if you can hire them there or what. But I should be good enough, I hope, for it. Trolls living under the bridge challenge you. Will you fight them? Well, let's try it. I'm not sure how many of them there are. Wow. That's a lot of them, actually. Okay, let's start with this troll group. You will also help with that. 
Do I have any skills? Curse, maybe. Any spells, I mean. Okay, let's start with some cursing then on this group of trolls. Now, do I need to like exchange some groups? Yeah, those genies are not really very healthy anymore. Let's help with this troll, and then what? Well, you can s hit, hit this troll for sure. That's not that big of an issue, I guess. Curse? This group? Okay. You can still hit once, that's okay. Then, uh, you will need to block one of the other groups. And you will need to do the same, pretty much. Okay, just kill this troll, please. Just kill it, please. Alright. I can actually kill this group now. You ideally just uh, wait around and see what happens. I think... Well, my nomads will be able to uh, get it done next turn. Hmm, just curse there, probably, and just wait. Yeah, I guess. Okay, is it dead? It's not dead. It's not dead, no. I can kill those trolls. Or almost kill them. Well, we can kill them with other genies, it's okay. Um... Yeah, I'll let him kill some nomads, actually. It doesn't really matter anyway, for me. Can do some, like, stone skin on my nomads, for example, and it's good enough, really. Something like this. No, he will not even be able to kill anything. Well, that was pretty clean. <laughs> Though, like, I didn't really know what to expect, so that was a bit reckless. A few trolls remain cowering under the bridge. They approach you and offer to join your forces as mercenaries. Do you want to buy any trolls? Hell yeah! Whoa, six of them. Whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's a lot of trolls. Um, I definitely do want to buy them, though, so let's do so. And then, like, um, that's a big army, actually. That is actually a big army. I do want to do something with this, but I'm not yet sure what. Like, um, is there another way out? I'm not sure. Yeah, probably, actually. Hmm. That's a hero, by the way. Well, obviously, like, obviously there would be an enemy above me, for sure. I'm not doubting that. But, like, maybe... I assume there is also another one to my left. Well, I... Hiring a new hero doesn't really help me that much at this point, I feel like. So let's just go with the... without any chains, just normally for this orc squad. And just do it next turn, pretty much. Uh, can we do something like this, please? Okay. Well, I'll just take this... Oh, come on, man. I need money! I need money! What is this? Statue, maybe? Just build a statue, whatever. Yeah, sure, whatever. We'll need that at some point. I don't... Like, I, I don't need a lot of money, but I need some money, you know? Alright. Uh, I can definitely get through those orcs. So let's do so. No, I don't exactly want to kill them. I could, though. Just for XP, honestly. It's not a threat. I can just kill them. Genies are really, really strong, so... Yeah, not a problem. And six trolls is also a lot. Six trolls is uh, how much you would have naturally by the second week. So, yeah, that's a lot of trolls. I'll make a quick detour for this gazebo. 
Leadership is okay. I don't... I'm not even sure I'll need Pathfinding anymore, so whatever. Cannot get it to this uh, castle on this turn. Um, The problem is... Well, it's not a problem yet. It's actually empty. <laughs> can I get there? Oh, 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 I can. <laughs> okay. I mean... Well... Uh, let's do so. I could have, like, exchanged uh, for some armies. Yeah, that's exactly my point. Uh, I assume there will be, like, some... Turrets already built. And that makes me want to collect some money, in fact. Can we do so? No, forget about this. I don't care about this Mercury, but I really would like some money. Because uh, I want to get some ogres. I want to get some ogres to protect this place, pretty much. Because if it has turrets, then it can defend itself. And, like, I don't really want to lose genies while trying to uh, storm it. So maybe just leave it like this for now? Okay, I don't really care about any of those resources, so just go, Mercury? Yeah, sure, I guess I can collect some Mercury, why not? Um, and build a marketplace maybe or something? While I can? Okay. That's about it. Yeah, so... I don't really even see any point in chasing this hero. I think I would rather just go for another castle. Oh, you know what I want to get, actually? I want to get the Thieves' Guild. Yeah, let's build that. How many enemies are there? Three of them, okay. Yeah, I would rather try to get to another enemy before we uh, get to week two, ideally. Well, I can kill uh, Jacqueline, that's not a problem. Sure, let's kill Jacqueline. Like, if I can, sure, why not? But, um... Something like this. Well, we'll kill goblins, that's not the issue there. Yeah, he'll not be able to do anything with this part. So let's just focus on those wolves. Done. Though, as I mentioned, there is no real reason for me to kill him even. Because uh, he can't really do anything. Well, I'll just leave it like this and I'll just go and collect some money. One uh, big point for Barbarian is that there are those watchtower objects on the map. And they allow you to get some uh, free orcs every week. And that's pretty good. That's pretty good. That allows you to get a big number of them. That uh, And a big number of any ranged unit is... Uh, that can be quite strong, at least like in terms of clearing out uh, neutral camps. And stuff like that. So, yeah. You'll just go with me purely for scouting, pretty much. Let's see if I can build anything. Yeah, I can uh, get ogres as well there. Bridge will require a lot of ore though, so we'll see about that. Okay. Where is the next castle though? Oh, here it is. Let's get some orcs, 10 of them, which is quite decent. I'll just drop them off by this castle. In case I just need them later for any reason, I can return. But I'll probably not need them. I'll probably be able to finish this map uh, before week two, in fact. Quite likely. Um, I would like to make some scouting to the south and maybe get to the next castle, or at least, like... Approximate its position somewhat. Bridge is good. Can I build anything meaningful? Like marketplace maybe? Okay, sure. Whatever. I would like another bridge, but it's not necessary really. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's his all, whole army pretty much. But he will not be able to get my castle. That's actually good. He will not be able to protect his own castle then. 
It's not this guy, however, it's the third barbarian. Well, I'll kill ogres, that's not the problem. Then I will have to... I can kill him. Okay, let's, uh, let's get the city, regardless. Do I want to split it differently? Not necessarily, I think this is fine, let's go. Probably will have to eat one uh, turn from his turrets, though. Probably will not be able to get it done. Maybe I will be able to. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Kinda didn't expect that. Okay. Uh, can I buy anything? Probably. Well, I definitely can buy one ogre. So here's what's gonna happen. We just run south, pretty much. Okay. And then there will be another hero. Let's say, uh, well, I don't know, sorceress maybe? Doesn't really matter, I suppose. Um, so yeah, you just leave all of your army in the city, get like one ogre for good measure. I can also sell some stuff. I have uh, a lot of marketplaces now, so that uh, allows me to get a lot of money potentially. And, um, and what? I cannot really build the bridge anyway, I need the ore. Well, I don't need bridge, that's fine. The idea is I'll just get this army and kill this guy. Maybe leave him at like one nomad. Don't really want to see that sprite. Something like this, yeah. Okay, let's kill it. I'll need to deal with it anyway, sooner or later. What spells do you have, by the way? Didn't check it, really. Slow and curse and bless. Interesting. Um, and cure, right? And cure, yeah. So if I... But he only can do one cure, so let's start with the slow on nomads. And even if uh, he heals them... And he doesn't. But that's okay, because now they will not really be able to do anything. And I can just... Uh, kill all his forces freely, pretty much. Man, that's some good stats, by the way. Seven attack, goddamn. Okay. My nomads will go next, and I'll be able to kill those wolves regardless. So let's start with his, with his nomads instead. He will still have, um, he will still be able to do one more cure if he chooses to do so. And he'll probably choose to do so. So what do we do about that? I can just run away, honestly. Hmm. My genie might die if I just leave it like that. But then I just win guaranteed pretty much. Um... So he did curse. He definitely has all of the spells. He definitely has cure. I'm trying to think of like a way to save my genie. But there is no good way. I would really like to kill his orcs as well. I don't really want to leave him, uh, leave them alive. No, you know what? I'm just... Uh, I think I'm just sacrificing this genie. But he will not be able to kill anything else, though. That's the idea. He's acting as if he doesn't have cure, which is very weird. I don't get it. Well, I'll just block with this genie just in case something goes wrong. But I can actually just shoot. Well, that's it then. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> I mean... Uh... I don't really get it. I don't really get how is it possible that he doesn't have cure. But, uh, okay. Okay, I can just kill him. At this point. What? Oh, I didn't slow them down anymore. God damn it. Well, it's still good enough though. 
Okay, let's curse them instead and let's just go for it. It shouldn't be that big of a problem anymore. They actually do quite a lot of damage. Didn't lose anything though. Oh, that's why he had uh, such good stats, I see. Okay, now we don't have to worry about uh, yellow anymore. And the only thing that is left is just this violet. Yeah, so here is the thing about violet, right? I do need to buy something in my city. And I have a lot of stuff to buy. I don't really even have to buy anything. I have like a lot of armies already there. I'll still buy some ogres, I suppose. Something like this. And that's good enough. Yeah, okay. Can return, I suppose. Maybe I'll even chase uh, Jezebel out of my place later. How do we get to Violet, though? This will definitely be one way. Will this road lead anywhere, though? Maybe that also. Maybe that also could be an idea. We'll see about it. Okay. First of all... I would like you to give me my army back. And I suppose the sword as well, why not? And then, is there anything? No, it's actually a dead end. Well, that explains it then. Um, then Mandigal will have to be the one who goes forward pretty much. I don't really need those orcs. I think my initial army is good enough, really. Something like this. Okay, you just go. Don't need to kill those rogues, pretty much. And then, uh, where are we going? There, I see. He will not be able to get his army back, so that's about it, really. I can just sit in this place, and then maybe I am counterattacking on the next week. Let's see. So, first of all, I definitely take his castle. That is happening. That's a good road there. Very helpful. Can I, like, use any magics? Some magics. Not a lot of it. Okay, I do want to kill some ogres. I don't want to kill some goblins. And then whatever. Maybe the rest of the ogres... Yeah, okay, some damage, but... It doesn't really matter anymore. Now, I don't think he would have any other heroes, realistically. So this is the only one. Can I get to it? Not really, no. Let me just see where it goes. Um, I want him to get a bit closer to me. And now I can just hit him. Yeah, I should be able to kill her with some trolls. Actually, it's eight trolls, not six. So it's five per week. Okay. Okay, it's pretty good. Let us just do like a, some good old fish fashioned barbarian showdown. Why not? Something like this. Can even like upgrade my ogres or something. 4k! That's a lot. Okay, and let's just go and kill her. This should be the last hero on the map. 39 orcs! That's way too many orcs. Curse them? Yeah, probably just curse them. Um... I can get a bit closer. I would like to get to the centaurs on the next turn, but... a lot of damage. Yeah, wolves will just die. It's because of this cactus. I blame this cactus. I would have gone like bottom if it was possible, but this cactus stopped me. Let's go for the centaurs and then also for orcs. I'll need to retreat or uh, those wolves will just eat me pretty much. Or, actually, I can just stay in place and kill them. That's also fine. Yeah, 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 they will die because of goblins. But that actually uh, forces those goblins to 
stay in place for a while. And that is also okay. Curse? Not necessary yet. Okay, I think we're just going for more orcs. Curse them again. Let's force those goblins to... Maybe it's actually better if they advance. I do want to get to orcs next turn, so maybe something like this. Just uh, try to get them out of there. And actually attack them, no? Yeah, let's actually make this attack. Okay, I can get two centaurs now. Now ogres will get two orcs next turn. Yeah, and then I'm winning this pretty much. That's fine. A lot of losses, but it's not really relevant since... Uh, this is the last fight on this map. It's quite a bit more bloody though than I expected originally. But he had a lot of orcs though from those watchtowers. What can you do? Okay, and that's it. I have a decision to make. It has come to my attention that Roland has struck an alliance with the King of the Dwarves. I am certain you recognize the potential danger this alliance presents to my... Uh, our position. At the same time, I have received a plea for help from the Necromancer's Guild. It seems that the Wizard's Guild has moved against their ancient rivals while they believe the Royal Forces to be otherwise occupied. The question I put to you, my general, is shall we shatter the Dwarven Alliance, or shall we rescue the Necromancer's Guild? Always do bonus missions. Oh, that's not a bonus mission! Wait, what? Two Guru Wizards have taken the Necromancer's Castle. You must retake it to achieve victory. Remember that while you start with a powerful army, you have no castle and must take one within seven days or lose this battle. Hint, the nearest castle is to the southeast. Uh, okay, and then... The dwarves need conquering before they can interfere in King Archibald's plans. Roland's forces have more than one hero and many towns to start with, so be ready for attack from multiple directions. You must capture all of the enemy towns and castles to claim victory. Well, uh, I'm not sure what the rewards for it would be. Necromancer. So would it be like uh, similar to my Sorcerer's Alliance from the previous? playthrough. I'm not sure. I think I'll do Necromancers first and then like the legit playthrough. Like I'll do both of those missions pretty much but I think uh, I'll do this one first and the dwarves would be for reals after that. Let's start with Necromancers any anyway and then uh, see what happens. So it's either gold or mask curse or defender's helm. I don't know. Mask curse seems fun but it's only for one hero though. Defender Helm? Yeah, okay, let's go for, with the uh, Defender Helm. The wizards who have captured the Necromancer's town have wasted no time in building defenses designed to stop you, and their last castle has just been completed. Fortunately, only a captain of the guard and a small garrison are currently present. If you hurry, you should be able to capture the castle before they have a chance to reinforce it. We start with actually a Warlock army, despite this being a Necromancer's playthrough apparently. Let's uh, get some scouting done first of all. Yeah, yeah. Do you really need hints when you have like an Observer Tower like that? Uh, so we'll definitely need to get there. Let's do so. Don't really have time to spend on getting those treasury chests. Um, okay. How do I get through them most efficiently? I'm not sure. Just get a couple of centaurs or something. Uh, split like at least uh, one gargoyle. Maybe. Okay, let's go. Oh, they run away anyway. I should get there by the next day anyway. So I'll just uh, spend some time getting this campfire. And let's go for some zombies now. 
Well, if they run away, it's again not really in my interest to chase them. No heroes. Some defenses, I suppose. Probably would be better if I just get all of my armies in one stack. Let's see. Yeah, not too bad. Not a lot of turrets, I hope. Not a lot of turrets, just one. Curse? Eh, don't really need a curse. Okay. So... Definitely can uh, and should stay in this castle. But I can't really get there. Okay, I'll need to hire some heroes for sure. Let's start with you. Cannot really even get more boars. That's unfortunate. Where can we get? I definitely need to do some scouting, but I cannot even get there without killing those rogues first. So maybe get to the east for now. See what's up there. Some treasure chests, some ore mines that I cannot really get to. That's unfortunate. A lot of rogues. Some orcs. Can get through orcs potentially, get some money if I want to. Or I can just uh, go south. I don't know if my current army is enough to actually deal any damage to the AI at this point. Maybe not. So yeah, that's a question, right? Where am I going? I should probably kill those rogues anyway, just to uh, get some money at least. That makes... Uh, seems like a good idea. I kinda should actually get one more hero. Before I, uh, before I'm completely out with my army. So I kind of want this gargoyle back. And that's the point. I don't really need more. This is fine. Now you can actually move. Yes. Now it's fine. Didn't split. I kind of assumed they would run away as well. And they didn't. It's okay though. Um, I can just wait there for now. I think this one will be able to get to my gargoyles. Or griffins, I suppose. Well, could have split my centaurs for sure. And I'm not sure. I guess he will just go ahead and, uh... Scout in front of me instead And you I'm not even I don't know no idea. Maybe just go back and get those chests That seems okay. Can I build anything? Wells Okay, I guess so Okay, and I'll cut the video there for now so for now thanks for watching and we'll continue with this in the next one